What's up guys, welcome back to The Educated Barfly. Today we're gonna to be making a modern reconstruction of a classic cocktail called a Barracuda. This modern reconstruction was created by Yale Vengroff of The Spare Room. She is the bar director there. And uh, she is also a very celebrated bartender in the Los Angeles community at this point. She's originally from Texas, moved to New York. She worked for Audrey Saunders over at the Pegu Club, I believe. And then she also joined uh, Proprietors LLC, which is the Death & Company guys. Uh, for menu development and cocktail development and now she heads up the spare room in Hollywood so if you guys are in Hollywood uh, it's at the historic Roosevelt Hotel right there on Hollywood Boulevard it is an amazing bar and you guys should go check it out okay so uh, in this cocktail we're going to be using uh, what are called shiso leaves I'm sure most of you guys know what a shiso leaf is but it's a leaf that is used in a lot of Japanese cooking and it has a very kind of interesting musky sort of spicy flavor to it all right so we're going to take two shiso leaves and put it into our tin all right put it into our tin and then we're going to add uh, two ounces of pineapple juice three quarters of an ounce of simple syrup we're just using a one-to-one -one simple three quarters of an ounce of lime juice quarter of an ounce of Clear Creek Pear Brandy and then two ounces of Plymouth Gin. Ah, and I dropped the cap, of course. Sorry guys, but I'm gonna go retrieve that. Whoa. At least I found it quickly. So a lot of you guys are gonna notice that this doesn't really have much to do with a like a classic barracuda, which is like white rum and galliano. Uh, but this is a, and usually if I were doing this, I would call it like a barracuda number two or whatever. Um, but the genesis of this cocktail was absolutely the barracuda. Um, and uh, so I think it deserves a name and I love that name and I love this cocktail. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our muddler and we're just gonna press our shiso leaves. We don't want to, um, press too hard because we want to just kind of release the flavor without like shredding the leaf and you're going to get a little bit of shredding when you shake anyway. Cool. Then we're just going to add our rock of ice into our glass. We're going to add our shaking ice into our tin. We're going to add the rest of the cocktail in and spill some of it as we do. And if we spill some of it, we lick it up off the... No, we don't do that. That's pathetic and that would mark you as an alcoholic. Don't do that. But just, you know, Honor the spill. All right, now let's give it a shake. All right, that shake was actually like, I think I slept funny last night. My neck kind of hurt a little bit this morning. And, um, and yeah, I just thought I'd just tell you guys that. I just whine a little bit for you, but it was like, I could feel that in the shake. It's like right there, a little kink, anyway. We're just gonna double strain. And nicely, like what I love about pineapple is that it aerates so nicely. There we go. That looks like a beautiful drink, my friends. And then I'm gonna take a shiso leaf. We're just gonna kind of like. Sorry, I have to turn it towards myself so I can kind of see. Usually shiso leaves are not so big. But like, that's a nice garnish, right? Just a little shiso leaf. Usually you get a little smaller shiso leaf, but the ones that I got when I went down to uh, Little Tokyo were just huge. So I'm working with a huge shiso leaf, guys. All right, let's take a sip. Ooh. Ooh, you know what's awesome is that like, I mean, you get the dryness of the pear brandy, and I can definitely taste it. And obviously, you can taste the pineapple juice, for sure. Absolutely, 100%. But, and the shiso leaf comes through so well, playing into the botanicals of the gin. And, you know, something like Plymouth, which has a lot of citrus in it, and some nice spice elements, uh, really make a very nice pairing with that shiso. Very refreshing, very light. Kind of tiki forward, but presented as a nice classic. I love it very much. There you have it, my friends. Yale Vengroff's Modern Reconstruction of the Barracuda. If you like our channel, please hit like and subscribe. 
And if you want to check us out on Patreon to see all the awesome exclusive content we be dropping there, go to patreon.com back, not backslash, I only say that. It's patreon.com slash the educated barfly. I will see you guys on a next tutorial sometime soon. Yes. See you next time.